guys, I just did a little clip on November the 5th supposed undocking of the Soyuz capsule from the International Space Station. And I found a lot of interesting things. As you can see, we've got some stuff going on here. There's some things that just don't look right. See those black square there in the middle and some things flapping right before it releases. And uh, what I think is going on here is this is in a tank. So this station is at the bottom of a pool. And the Soyuz capsule is on the end of a cable being winched up so you're looking downwards into the pool. So right now you're being winched up. You can even see the twist and then torque in motion of the capsule as it's being pulled up away from the station inside a swimming pool. Alright, lights, camera, action. Here we go. Get those stadium lights on. See how they're lighting from behind and below. See the little flashes of uh, the little boosters once in a while. Those are fake too. If you slow it down and stop it, you'll notice every time it flashes, it's in the exact same <coughs> exact same area. And there goes a bubble, bubble from the tank. Whoops! They tried to speed up the film so it was harder to see those things, but. I still seen it. All right, here's a CG transition because all of a sudden the Earth shows up. Still notice how the lighting source is from the bottom and below, but look, you can see the sun is to the bottom right corner of the planet. Why isn't the right side of the station lit up? All right, we're all CG now can actually see the the masking lines around the station it's very faint but you can see it if you pause it you can see the straight lines and actually you can see an error coming up right here in the CG the tiny little panel it's having a hard time processing it it wants to disappear and goes opaque you see a little bit little bit of it and then it totally disappears Here's that masking line I was talking about in the missing panel. And it was a good attempt. Like I said, I give it a four star rating for attempt. This footage is actually zoomed in in the editor. I believe it's probably 180%. I added this fine edge filter to show you that this thing is fake as all hell. This, if it was a real object, you would, it'd be sharp and clear, and it isn't. And here you have it. NASA's fakery. And if Russia wants to stay relevant, they better get the hell out of this program and expose it for what it is, because they're playing along with it. If you enjoyed this little clip, like and share, and leave a comment and tell me what you think. There's lots of other things in there for people to see, so take a close look at it.